So we're getting ready to start replacing the floorboards. Now, one thing that they, we noticed is that the last owners of the boat, when they replaced the floor, they actually cut their boards to fit on the inside of this lip here. And that really defeats some of the strength. So what we did is we oversized our boards so that way there's plenty of overlap over this edge. So that's going to give the board a lot of extra strength going all the way across the floor. Now, one thing to note is way back in the corner, the boat channel kind of curves in like this a little bit. So if you look at our boards, which you might not be able to see because of the sun here, let me get on this side. So with that curve, we added a little cut on the inside to fit in there. Now, one of the reasons why they undercut their boards is because of these trays here. Now, they're in the way, so if you had a properly sized board, you wouldn't be able to get it in because those trays were obviously installed after the floor in the original boat. So the last people just decided, screw it, they'll make them undersized and just throw them in the bottom of the floor. But what we're gonna do is, we were planning to move these trays lower so that way we could add in some more rods on the side. So we're gonna remove those anyway, so it actually works out really great. We're drilling out all of the rivets that hold these trays in. On this side, we already removed the tray. So when we get ready to reinstall those, we're just gonna plug those holes with the proper size bolts and nuts, seal them with some marine sealant, and move them down a little bit further. So right now we have the rear board for the floor made. We still need to pop the fiberglass in. But we wanted to feel like we're getting closer on the boat progress, so we decided to put our batteries in the back here and just see how they would all fit. So as you can see, we have four Ys uh, lithium iron phosphate batteries. So we have a fifth battery on the way, which is going to be the starter battery, but it just hasn't come yet. But you can see we have plenty of room. We have plenty of room for that battery on this side. So we have plenty of room right in the middle for an extra gas can, extra tackle, you know, small child, whatever you want to fit in the back. So this is going to be really great. <laughs> 